friends welcome to my channel today i am going to make a beautiful square out of these two colors you can use this square for making shawls blankets table cover bed cover and table runner too and i am going to use a hook of 2.5 mm for this project we are going to begin with yarn of color a and red slip knot we have to do chain 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 now we have to go back to the first chain insert the hook in yarn over pull through both the loops this is slip stitch chain 1 2 3 which counts as a double crochet insert the hook into the ring pull through pull through two pull through two double crochet two three four we have to do 16 double crochet into the ring including these four so complete the round and we will meet again when this round will be completed when we have completed 16 double crochet we have to join the stitches into the third chain of the fourth stitch with slip stitch the fourth round is complete chain 1 2 3 which counts as a double crochet chain 1 for chain 3 on the top of the next stitch double crochet 1 chain 1 for chain 3 on the top of the next stitch double crochet 1 chain 1 for chain 3 on the top of the next stitch double crochet 1 chain 1 for chain 3 follow the same pattern and complete the round we'll meet again when this round will be completed when this round is complete we have to do chain 1 now we have to join the stitches into the third chain of the fourth stitch with slip stitch we have to come to this chain space of one with slip stitch pull the yarn a little on yarn over insert the hook into the chain space of one pull through one Two and three. Pull through all the loops. Pull through chain one, two, three for chain space. Yarn over into the next chain space of one. Pull through one, two, and three. Pull through all the loops. Pull through chain one, two, three for chain space. Into the next chain space of one. Pull through one, two. And three. Pull through all the loops. Pull through chain one, two, three for chain space. Complete the round following the same pattern, and we will meet again when this round will be completed. When this round is complete, we have to do chain three. Now, on the top of the fourth petal, insert the hook and pull through. Pull through two. We have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add yarn of color B from the next round. We have to begin with. slip knot now into this chain space of 3 insert the hook and pull through pull through 2 join the yarn with slip stitch chain 1 2 3 which counts as a double crochet double crochet 2 3 chain 1 2 for chain space into the same chain space of 3 double crochet 1 2 3 4 chain 1 2 3 join these stitches into this chain space of 3 with slip stitch chain 1 2 3 4 5 into this chain space of 3 Join the stitches with slip stitch. Chain one, two, three, four, five. Into the next chain space of three. Join the stitches with slip stitch. Chain one, two, three. Into the next chain space of three. Double crochet one, two, three, four. 
chain 2 for chain space into the same chain space of 3 double crochet bar 2 3 4 chain 1 2 3 join these stitches into the next chain space of 3 this slip stitch so these are the corners of the square and this is the four side of the square follow the same pattern and complete the round we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to do chain 3 now we have to join these stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch on the top of the four stitch chain 3 which counts as a double crochet on the top of the next stitch double crochet 2 on the top of the next stitch 3 4 on the top of the next stitch into this chain space of 2 double crochet 1 2 and 3 chain 2 for chain space into the same chain space of 2 double crochet 1 2 and 3 on the top of next 4 stitches we have to do 4 double crochet 1 2 3 4 chain 1 2 3 4 5 join these stitches into the next chain space of 5 with slip stitch chain 1 2 3 4 5 join these stitches into the next chain space of 5 with slip stitch chain 1 2 3 4 5 on the top of these 4 stitches we have to do 4 double crochet into this chain space of 2 3 double crochet chain 2 and 3 double crochet Complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed. When the round is complete, we join the stitches on the top of the 4 stitch with slip stitch. Now on the top of the 4 stitch, chain 1, 2, 3 which counts as a double crochet. On the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1. 1 double crochet on the top of the next stitch. 1 double crochet on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next one double crochet on the top of the next stitch into this chain space of two double crochet one two three chain two for chain space into the same chain space of 2, double crochet 1, 2 and 3. Now we have to do 1 double crochet on the top of all these stitches. So double crochet 1 on the top of the next stitch, double crochet 2, 3 on the top of the next stitch, 4 on the top of the next stitch. 5 on the top of the next stitch, 6 and 7, chain 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 for chain space, skip this chain space of 5 into the next chain space of 5, double crochet 1, chain 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. On the top of next 7 stitches we have to do 7 double crochet and into this chain space of 2, 3 double crochet, chain 2 and 3 double crochet. Follow the same pattern and complete the round. We will meet again when this round would be completed. When the round is complete, we joined the stitches on the top of the 4 stitch with slip stitch. On the top of the 4 stitch, chain 1, 2, 3 which counts as a double crochet, chain 1, 2, 3 for chain space. Skip 2 stitches on the top of the next stitch, double crochet 1, chain 1, 2, 3 for chain space. 
skip two stitches on the top of the next stitch double crochet one chain one two three for chain three skip two stitches on the top of the next stitch double crochet one into the chain space of two double crochet one two and three chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one two and three on the top of the fourth stitch of the next cluster double crochet one chain one two three for chain space skip two stitches on the top of the next stitch double crochet one chain one two three for chain space skip two stitches on the top of the next stitch double crochet one chain one two three for chain space skip two stitches on the top of the next stitch double crochet one chain one two three into this chain space of five double crochet one chain one two three for chain space on the top of the next stitch double crochet one chain one two three for chain space into the next chain space of five double crochet one chain one two three for chain space on the top of the next stitch double crochet one follow the same pattern and complete the round we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we join the stitches on the top of the fourth stitch with slip stitch now we have to come to this chain space of three with slip stitch chain one two three four five join these stitches into the next chain space of three with single crochet chain one two three four five join these stitches into the next chain space of five with single crochet chain one two three four five now into this chain space of two double crochet one two and three chain one two three four join these stitches on the top of the same stitch for five cords into the same chain space of three double crochet one two and three chain five one two three four five join these stitches into the next chain space of three with single crochet chain one two three four five join these stitches into the next chain space of three with single crochet complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed this square is going to look like this when it will be completed you can join this square to the other square while making these chains these are five chains we have to make chain two and join the other motif chain two again again we have to do chain two join the other motif with slip stitch chain two and then we have to join the stitches with single crochet this way we can join these squares together to make bigger projects like bed cover table mats table cover cushion cover and blankets baby blankets too thank you so much